Hey, what's up guys? It's Matt from Diablo Sport here, and we are going to be doing a quick Tech Tuesday uh, tutorial on tuning this uh, Diablo Sport Predator 2 on this 2015 Ford F-350 with the 6.7 liter power stroke. Now, the first step I've done is put the key in and turned it to the on position, not run, just the key in the on position, and connected the Predator 2 to the diagnostic port right there. And uh, we are going to start the tuning process. So when you power it up, it's gonna come up straight to this tune setting, uh, which gives you the ability to go in and select your power levels. You also have the ability to scan for diagnostic trouble codes, read vehicle information, um, and this will give you a lot, of, this section will give you a lot of device info uh, as well. So we're gonna go back to tune, press okay. Uh, the ignition is already on, so we'll just go ahead and press okay. Now it's gonna start communicating with the truck. When it does that, the center or console and the uh, radio all of it's going to power off as it's gaining access to the vehicle. Now once it's started communicating, you'll see the uh, center cluster come up and the sync system will start doing, if you have that, if your vehicle's equipped with that, it'll come up and say it's performing scheduled maintenance, which is totally normal as well. Uh, now you can see those red boxes basically state that that's the performance setting that we're in. We're going to be programming back to economy. So hit the down button a couple times, go to economy, press OK. It is going to tell you that this is designed for performance increase and uh, fuel economy increase. And you can tow up to 6,000 pounds with this tune. Dependent upon which level you have, it'll give you some information about that level right there. We're gonna press okay to continue. Now the device is gonna check to see what other custom options we have available. Um, it, it'll come up with this menu asking if you want to uh, customize any options. We're gonna hit okay, even though we're not gonna change any of these. But just to give you an idea, on this 2015 Ford, we've got the ability to adjust the speed limiter, axle size, tire size, torque management, trans shift level, adjust the front TPMS, rear TPMS, and disable TPMS altogether, or continue. Uh, we're not going to adjust any of those right now. We're just gonna hit continue. It's gonna start building the tuning file. As you can see, the sink is performing its maintenance, should be done here in a second, and come right back up to the radio. Now, it's asking, do you want to program the tuning file? We're going to hit OK for yes. So let me turn the ignition off real quick. OK. And then we'll press OK when completed. Waiting for the vehicle to power down. Well, there it is. Turn the key back on. Okay. So we turn the key on, press OK. Now it's back to communicating with the vehicle. So as you can see, cluster and radio are turned off and we're going to watch it do the performance tuning. So this is definitely a simple process and it really gives you the ability to put in whatever level you want for whatever driving condition you, you may need, whether it be the performance tune, the economy tune, the tow performance tune, or even back to stock if, if you want to go back there. But honestly, once you've driven this truck uh, tuned compared to factory, you're not going to want to spend a whole lot of time on stock. Um, and I wanted to talk real quickly about, well, while this is tuning, I'll talk real quickly about another upgrade that uh, we sell at Diablo Sport that's a fantastic upgrade to this truck and it's the Amped Throttle Booster. Um, basically that throttle booster, it's pure design is to increase response and change the throttle curve to make it a more, you know, more fun, basically a more <laughs> funner driver experience. Uh, it makes it a lot more responsive um, and uh, reduces a lot of the turbo lag, you know, so when you, you're turning onto a road and you're trying to get out in front of traffic, um, and it takes so long to spool up and you just feel like you're going nowhere, it eliminates that entirely, uh, makes a big difference, and it pairs perfectly with these tunes. And, and to be honest, when you are on a medium to high amped uh, throttle booster level, uh, which that's it right there, see that little red dot? That's the amped power switch, gives you all the adjustments all in one spot. Um, but when you're in the, like a mid throttle level uh, on the amped and you're in a performance tune on the Predator, uh, this truck moves. Uh, it, it is definitely responsive. It is a humongous increase in performance uh, for, for you when, when that's what you're looking for. 
Uh, so now we're getting close to wrapping up programming file one of two. So we'll just watch the rest here. All the cluster and everything is still down until it's getting further along in the process. Now after it does a performance tuning session, it always will clear DTCs, uh, which is diagnostic trouble codes totally normal and exactly what it's supposed to do. Sounds like the air turned back on. It's programming the second file in here. We've had pretty dang good luck with this Predator 2. Um, it's been an awesome product line for us. The Predator, as many of you may know, was what really put Diablo Sport on the map uh, back in the day. Uh, you know, you if you were tuning a gasoline or a diesel vehicle, uh, once upon a time you were likely tuning it with the Predator. Uh, now that uh, the Predator 2 is back in a new form factor with a little bit of a throwback to the original look, uh, this thing's better than ever. Uh, the new button interface and color screen is definitely a lot easier to use and the user interface altogether and the whole experience is just an easier one. Um, so we really love this. Uh, you know, customers like yourself have loved it as well. It's been a, a great success for us and we're really glad to have the Predator 2 lineup back in the uh, Diablo Sport product mix. So we're just about done here with programming file two of two setting the vehicle and our cluster is likely going to come back up here in just a second. Okay, now it wants us to turn the ignition off. Okay, press OK. It's going to wait for the vehicle to power down. Oh, no, nope, John, we're good. Tuning file installed. So we're all done. I'll press OK to continue. And at this point, it's back to the main menu and we can start the truck. Starts up just like it should. We are good to go. So that's a quick tutorial on how to tune or change levels on a Predator 2 for a Ford Power Stroke. This is going to be the same process for uh, really any vehicle uh, with maybe some small differences in timing and whatnot. But generally speaking, this is a great product for this vehicle. Uh, check it out at DiabloSport.com today.